After moving to Guam, Tony Thompson became part of the Friars family. He was first a PE teacher, who later became vice principal, athletic director, and principal of Father Duenas Memorial High School. Tony Bloss has worked at FD for 24 years, with Mr. Thompson by his side. He remembers him as the epitome of a role model. No one works harder. No one loves harder. No one cared more, no one gave more. I wish I could be just a little bit like him. If everyone was a little bit like Mr. Thompson, the world would be a better place. Students left flowers on the table he sat every lunch break, remembering a man who cared for every single student like a father. He would help us through any obstacle, academic related or what. And he really saw you, you know, as his son more than, more than just a student of his. He was a lot of things. He was a father figure. He was a leader. He was a light in the darkness. He was kind of like uh, the foundation of, or the rock of FD. He kept things, he had a calming presence when things would get crazy. Mr. Bloss's junior students telling stories of how they hoped he would be there for their senior year. He just said it was going to be a good year and he was going to watch out for our class, keep our class in check, even though we get out of hand a lot of times. But yeah, we all saw him as a father figure and we will do him proud. I also remember him at every rugby game, every football game that I watched, every wrestling match. He was always there and he was just supporting us making sure we didn't start anything or anything like that. And there's one thing I always remember about him, how much he cared about all of us. Gone too soon, but never forgotten. These students and teachers, just some of the lives that were forever changed knowing Coach Tomps. Others taking to social media to honor his legacy. Kaya Kimoto says, will live on. I challenge the rest of the brotherhood to realize that, you know, that we, we have to live on and continue Mr. Thompson's work. The Archdiocese and former FD principal, Father Jeff Nicholas, also extend condolences to the family. Thompson is survived by his wife, Angela, their son, and their two daughters.